Is it, sweetie? I said, what was that noise? Nothing, sweetie. I just ran over a big frog. No, you didn't, Mommy. Frogs don't sound like that. Mommy, I'm bored. I want to open my eyes. <sighs> Please, just be a good girl and keep your eyes closed like I told you. Okay, sweetie? Say, buddy, you mentioned something about research for a story. That's right. You got a tip that something big's happening. In a nowhere little town like that, they sure didn't mention anything about it on TV. Yeah, well, I'm freelance, pal. I don't make my living waiting for the TV to tell me what to cover. <laughs> Hey, 
Here she is. <laughs> Willamette, Colorado. Population 53,594. Distinguishing characteristics, jack shit. <laughs> About the only thing to do in this town is kill time at the shopping mall. What was that? The army? Yeah. <laughs> Looks like taking a helicopter was the way to go. I bet they got all the roads blocked off by now. All right, listen. I want to get shots of the whole town before the National Guard finishes roping it off. Take me over the main street. for sure. Whatever's going on down there, it's not business as usual in this town. Check out that building. Huh? Where? Right below us.
see the center of town. Take me there. Roger. kidding me oh man you are nuts all right listen don't forget to come back for me as long as you're not dead Fred it's Frank Frank West remember that name because the whole world's gonna know it in three days when I get to school all right Whoa! Shit. Oh. <laughs> Get us back down to that rooftop! I know I'm gonna get my butt chewed up for this one. We're going down. Hello there. Huh? You're the reporter, aren't you? Yeah. Uh... You... came alone? Yeah. I'm freelance. You know. Going the battlefield alone. No crew. So, uh... What's going on around here anyway? You came by helicopter, didn't you? What did you see from the sky? Well, if it were just a riot, I doubt the military would quarantine the entire area. The moratorium on information getting out is a little extreme, in my opinion. There's uh, something else I can't put my finger on. Doesn't sound like civil disobedience. It's too quiet. <laughs> Almost as if. Everyone's already dead? Yeah. So why don't you just tell me already? What's going on? I think you'd better see for yourself. This, my friend... ...is hell. Looks like you're the only j that made it out here. I'm looking forward to some nice pictures. <laughs> right.
Bring that over here. Madonna, where is my little? Oh. Quit screwing oh. around. Oh. 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 Madonna, oh. have you seen my baby? I can't live without my precious little sweetie doggy. Oh, where is my Madonna? Where is she? Oh, oh, Madonna. This is no time to ogle pretty girls, son. You looking to get yourself eaten alive by zombies? What? Did you just say zombies? Take a look out there. Those ain't zombies. What would you call them? There's been more and more of them since last night. Now? They're all that's out there. Eh, look on the bright side. Zombies are stupid and slow. <laughs> we should be safe in here. All right then, feel like making yourself useful? Take a look around the mall and bring anything we can use for the barricade back here. On the leg, come on, pronto. For a living. Work? Perfect. <laughs> Is that what you call that hanky panky with that big titted secretary now? Oh, please. What the hell does that have to do with anything? Listen to you. Every time something goes wrong, you have to raise your voice. I never should have married you. You want to split up then? Sounds great. I can't wait to see the look on your face when those zombies eat you. It'll be hilarious. That's my line, Buster. Idea what you've uh. done! Why did you summon me to this place? What are you planning? Would you calm down? I don't even know what you're talking about. <laughs> what the? What in the hell are you people 
Someone, move this way! Quick, to the stairs! Move! Where are the others? I don't know. I hope they got away. <sighs> as long as those things are in the mall, we'd better not use this door. What are you doing? The air ducts. They'll get us back into the mall. And apparently, those things aren't smart enough to use the ducts. So they won't be a factor. Wait a minute. You want to get back in there? What for? Hey. Hey. Nice camera. Are you a photographer? As a matter of fact, I am. Frank West, photojournalist. Could you show me some pictures, Frank? <sighs> you really seem to know what you're doing. Who are you guys, anyway? Then what are you? I took that one near the entrance. That guy do something? Nope. Thanks for showing me, though. Uh, hey, we're not done talking yet. Just who are you guys? I'm Jesse. The man you saw earlier is Brad. That's all I'm authorized to tell you. down into the mall, are you? I wouldn't do that if I were you. But you young folks never listen to me. Well, if you're gonna go, at least take this transceiver with you. You better take this map, too. Huh.
Good. I can't answer your questions. Even if we rounded up everyone responsible and arrested them, I've still got my hands full with everything else that's going on around here. Have you seen my wife, yeah. Natalie? She should still be around here. Looking for someone? I'll lend a hand. Oh, that'd be great, fella. The name's Jeff Meyer, by the way. I'm Frank. I'm a journalist. Let you go again. All right, you two. You mind cutting your joyous reunion short? It's not safe here, but I know a place. I'll take you to the security room. Follow me. I'm never going to the mall again as long as I live. I've had about enough of this. Ugh! 
Jeez. Zombies, huh? Had a feeling you'd show up. You look, don't sneak up on me. Brad was attacked. I located him on the monitor. It, it's probably just a sprain. I've got to help Brad, or he's done for. All right, fine. Give me your gun. Come on, I'm the reason you just got hurt. Let me help. No, I can't let a civilian do that. That's against regulations. Yeah, well, I don't think they had zombie-infested malls in mind when they wrote those regulations, kid. You know how to use this? Kinda. I've covered wars, you know. Look, after I'm through helping you, you and I are gonna have a nice little chat. Yeah! 
sent me to find you. Who? Jesse? Damn it! Okay, we'll have to talk about this later. You know how to use that gun? I've never fired at a person. All right, I'll cover you from here. You need to stick to the shadows. Try to get close to the target, okay? And what am I supposed to do when I get close? <laughs> Well, the best solution would be to shoot the guy. But if you can't do that, keep him busy dodging your bullets and stay out of trouble. Are you up to it? I'm a lot better with a camera. But yeah, I'll give it a shot. All right. Next time he reloads, I'll lay down a suppressing fire. I'm counting on you. Make your way over there. One, two, three! Got away. Who was that anyway? I don't know. Well, thanks for your help. The name's Brad. 
I'm Frank West, photojournalist. And right now, I'd rather have an explanation than your thanks, Brad. Sorry. I've got nothing to tell you. Look. I don't know what Jesse told you. But as far as I'm concerned, we're through working together. So you cover your zombie story and leave the rest to us. You, uh, you guys are looking for someone here, aren't you? Hmm? Who is that? Where did you take- You help me, I help you. You're one hell of a journalist, aren't you, Frank? A hot-headed, underhanded, hot-shot paparazzi with nothing better to do than to invade people's privacy. I try. You got a point? You win, Frank. Let's work together. Jesse and I are DHS agents, and yes, we are looking for the man in that picture. <laughs> You're with Homeland Security? Is that guy a terrorist or something? I took that picture in the entrance plaza. Right near the front door. The entrance plaza. You're sure? Hey! So do I have your permission to cover this story, or not? 